Uh, Dryad is a project that allows uh, regular developers to do distributed computing at a large scale uh, in a simple way. A small data set might be uh, tens of gigabytes and medium size would be maybe a couple of terabytes and some jobs go up to hundreds of terabytes. The sets are too large to analyze on a single computer. You know, in the past maybe you've done it using SQL Server and now you want to use a cluster of hundreds or maybe even thousands of computers and so we need a simple way to program those clusters. Over the last 10 years or so, more and more people have had access to very large data sets. So writing distributed computation is hard and uh, there are a lot of things you need to be concerned about, like fault tolerance and how the things are being managed on a large data center. So what the combination of Dryad and the Dryalink allows you to write very simple program, and the programmer does, doesn't have to know anything about distributed computation. So the program is compiled, and there is execution, Dryad execution plan is generated, and the, and so the, the entire computation is shaped to the cluster, and so the, uh, the program is executed there, and the result comes back. Dryad is the system that executes the program that you write, and it's in charge of taking the program that you've written on your local computer, shipping it out to all of the computers in the cluster, and then managing the parts of the program as different parts execute on the different computers, monitoring those. If there's a failure somewhere, rerunning that failed part, and at the end, gathering together all of the answers and re reporting them back to your local computer. Uh, there's a programming language which we call Dryad Link, which is a combination of the link operators that are in the standard .NET languages and our distributed ex execution system, which is called Dryad. Well, the basic idea is that any, pro any program who can write program in .NET and a Link should be able to write a Dryad program. So Dryad lets researchers and, and uh, practitioners do things they couldn't do before, partly just because of the, the saving in time. So if there's a job that you need to run every day, it has to take less than a day to run. And so certainly at Bing, that's very important. They have daily jobs that would have taken weeks before they had a distributed computing system like Dryad. There are also problems that have a very large working set, and so they need a lot of memory. And so being able to use all of the computers in a cluster at once um, make those jobs feasible where they wouldn't have been feasible before. As computing is increasingly moving away from the desktop and into the cloud, more and more people are going to be using systems like Dryad uh, to run their jobs on clusters whether they know it or not.